Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KJ4 Rate, and we're going to be taking a look at a new game called Pathless Woods. Embark on a cozy open world survival journey. Gather resources, cultivate crops, build your dream home, and defend it from marauders. This game is on Steam for $20, but right now it's 10% off until April 16th. Thank you to the developers for sending me a key. Let's get started. We're going to call the world name Season 1. It's got a world ID. I'm going to re-roll that a couple times just for the lulls. Um, this kind of feels like it's a game seed, which means that the game is not pre-built. Now, I don't know if this game's pre-built. I don't really know much about the game. I don't know if it's pre-built. I don't know if it's pre procedurally generated. So we're just going to kind of have to figure that out as we go along. Let's go ahead and create the world. So we have to select our character. There is a male and a female, and they each have different, like, bonuses down here. This one's got um, incredible damage resistance in moments of peril, and also... Uh, exceptionally strong physique and then if you pick the girl she's harboring a tree spirit within her she is protected from physical harm harboring a tree spirit in her body she receives additional um, assistance when collecting um, since childhood these hands have never touched any laboring materials unable to launch unarmed attacks okay well, I'm gonna pick the dude because I'm a dude and I don't think you can do too much with like with them I don't even know if you can name or anything I don't see anything about that um, but you can pick a different, I guess, I'm going to call it a tunic. Uh, and check this out. I like this one right here. And you get it through in-game in -game exploration. That's really cool. I like the idea of getting cooler looking tunics. Oh, why would it change my hair color? That's kind of weird. I didn't notice that. Oh, it changes it. Yeah, okay. All right. I, I don't know why it changed the hair color, but it is what it is. I'm going to take this one because it makes me look a little bit more li like Link. And we're going to go ahead and enter the world. And here we are in the world uh safe rival so i'm going to tell you guys uh this is the way the game starts you off with is like kind of like way up here and you kind of run around down here and everything um i like to hold control and mouse wheel to zoom in all right and then you can hold down the right mouse button to like kind of move the camera down a little bit and then lastly i'm going to press middle mouse button which is going to get rid of the pointer and it's going to allow me to run around the way i would want to so if you if you have the pointer out and you run around the camera won't Go be it won't stay behind you if you leave this out it will stay behind you um, this is the way i kind of like to play all right let's go ahead and talk to this dude safe arrival continue you would have been stuck there yeah there's like a little bit of a tutorial in the beginning this guy brought me here so that's what we got going on now he's going to give us a little bit of a tutorial or like not a tutorial but like guidance so we have to harvest yam um, and get two ripe yam. So the ripe yam is these things right here. I'm going to move the camera a little bit more. Yeah, I kind of like that. All right, we're going to harvest these. Some are not ripe, and you can't get the ones that aren't ripe, which is makes this easy. There we go. We got our two yam. I'm also going to hold down, uh, press F to pick up everything in the... Well, hold F to pick up one thing. Sorry. <laughs> Let me try that again. Press F to pick up one thing. Hold F to suck up everything like a freaking vacuum cleaner. Pick some more of this stuff. There we go. All right, that's all looking good. So now we need to make a flint knife, stone pickaxe, and stone axe. So we're going to press Z to bring up the crafting menu. We're going to make the flint knife first. Then we're going to need some rope. So um, I forget how I get rope. I think I picked these up for rope. Did that unlock rope? Yes, it did. Okay. What are they called? I wasn't looking. <laughs> it's in my inventory, though. Uh, let's take a look. Uh, B, and then it's um, common rush. That's how you make rope. Okay, so let's go ahead and make some rope. We're going to need two rope. Batch craft. What does that do? Does it do everything? Oh, you get to choose. Okay, cool. So we'll do two because I know that's what we're going to need. And then we're going to need an axe and a pickaxe. Boom. Quest complete. Collect common rush. 25. Collect wood. Collect stone. Okay. Um, so common rush. There we go. Should I be collecting that with my knife or... I don't know. Maybe you don't have to use them. I'm not really sure. Let's see. Quick empty harvest. Get more if you use your knife. Yes, you do. Is it popping up telling me how many I get? Oh, I pulled them completely out of the ground. Here, it looks like they're going to grow back. Yeah, okay. I'm pretty sure I'm getting more with my knife. Although we should probably test just to see. All right, we got two there. So let's go ahead and put away the knife and pull it up and see what happens. Uh, did I put away my knife? I did. Pull it up. Yep. Okay. 
So r ripping it out of the ground gets you half. It gets you one. And using your knife gets you two, and it also allows you to, it also allows you to grow back. There we go. Cool. Okay, cool. So what about trees? Let's go ahead and look at some trees here. Uh, I do want to kind of mess around my inventory a little bit. I think I'm going to... I want to leave the number one slot for a weapon, the number two slot for a ranged weapon. I don't even know if there's ranged weapons in the game. Uh, but, you know, it is what it is. We'll just kind of put that stuff up there. So let's go three for the axe. And there's like a little chopping mini game. You just hold down the button, and when it's in the middle, you let it go. And if you get it right, you get a critical strike. There we go. Looking good. Hold down F to pick everything up quickly. What is that? Oh, hold on. Stop that. Oh, it's a nut. Okay. Cool. I mean, oh, you can plant trees. Dude, if you could plant trees, that'd be freaking awesome. Just saying. Just throwing that out there. All right, let's go ahead and mine some stone. This looks like iron or something. Um, oh, that's copper. So I'm going to look for some regular stone. Um, although, I don't know. Maybe I should just do the copper. You probably get stone from the copper as well. But let's go for the stone. Because who knows? There might be a quest to ask you to get, you know, to get copper. Oh. Oh, that's copper. Okay, never mind. I didn't see the copper and I wasn't reading the name of the item I was at. All right, so we have to find some regular stone. Is, what is this? Stone pile. Dig. Okay. Uh, whoops. Whoops. It looks like the little thing in the middle for the stone is a little bit smaller. A little bit harder to get it right. What you want to do is you want to... The way I find that to work out well is if you let go before they're together because your eyes are not keeping up with the, what the game's showing you so you really want to let it go early although now i'm letting it go too early there we go cool cool all right let's go ahead and collect the rest of this stuff for this quest apparently my character is a little too warm but i'm not going to worry about it because you know what am i going to do <laughs> what am i going to do man look at that flying thing over there what the heck that's freaking wicked all right, what's next? Um, the foundation of production. Build open, build slash open a workbench. Press X to open building page. All right, so we need a workbench. So is that under building or crafting? I don't know. I think it's under building, but I'm not really sure. Uh, what is this? Um, wooden grill rack. Yes, yeah, so we could cook food. That's looking good. Let's look, let's look at building. So we've got, oh, that's a workbench. It looks like a, it looks like a freaking... <laughs> It looks like a, a, a what do you call it? A, um, a foundation. <laughs> All right, we're gonna make two of these, and then we'll make one of these. It's kind of weird. I'm gonna put it right next to this water because the water is where I'm gonna be drinking out of. Cool. Awesome. Make a stone hammer. Open workbench. Find and click stone hammer and build it. Okay. Um, fine. Can we search? It doesn't look like we can search. Uh, find and click stone hammer. Okay. Well, it's right there. So I guess it doesn't matter. All right. Rope it is. Craft the rope. This crafting menu is going to take a little bit of time for me to get used to, but I'm sure it's a fine crafting menu. I'm just, uh, you know, trying to get used to it. Also, if your UI looks a little bit different than mine, um, I went to... First of all, let's save. I went to settings, and then I went to display, and I have my UI scale on 80%. I put it on 60%, and I like the UI on 60%, but if it's on 60%, the text gets too small for me to be able to read. All right, build at least four foundations. Okay, so then we build like a shelter. Okay, that sounds good. Uh, let's take a look. Uh, where are the foundations? Crafting all functions. I am getting quite hungry and thirsty, so I'm going to go ahead and... Oh, you know what? I... Wait, do I want to use the knife on these? I'm not really sure. Uh, we're going to get these uh, radishes. I don't know if we get more with the knife or not. Probably. I hope they regrow, though. <laughs> oh, I'm getting saplings and stuff, too. Okay. All right, very good. Well, actually, those are saplings are on the ground. And we did get seeds. All right, cool. So let's go ahead and do some eating. Oh, no, that's throwing. You have to press E to eat. Yum, yum, yum. Oh, you actually get some water from these as well. Man, I'm gonna have to eat them all. That's, that didn't even do that much. Holy crap. Okay. Well, it is what it is. All right, let's go ahead and do foundations. We got we got some foundations right here. Uh, let's just build... I'm gonna build five of them because I usually like to have a porch. Uh, let's do... I don't know. 
That seems pretty good to me. One, two, three. Uh, let's put the other ones behind it. And one more. Come on. All right, cool. Let me get rid of that. Escape? Okay, that works. All right, now we need four walls. Uh, we're going to have to make a staircase first, though. Or a little uh, wooden stairs here. Uh, we're going to need some more rope. Should I just make a bunch of rope? or? Yeah, I'm going to make, like, five rope. Oops. I'm going to make, like, five rope. Let's try that again. There we go. And then build. We'll build one of these. Looks good to me. Keep it simple. Cool. It's gonna be a small house at first, but that's okay. Uh, I don't even think I, I don't even think I'm gonna be living here. I think this is like a, just teaching how to build. So it's just you know, don't need to get too fancy with it. All right, so we need four walls. Uh, one, two, four walls. We need more than four walls, but okay. So we are on structure. Oh, it's a little hard to see this because I made the I made the thing so small. Um, but that's okay. Uh, wooden wall. We're gonna need one, two. Well, our window's different. Let's just make four for now. So here we go. I couldn't figure out how to make the walls with like window openings. Uh, we'll kind of look into that later. Um, and I did start the roof. I also had to put down a bed because it got really late and I had to sleep through the night. And I also made a fire because I had to get some food. Now let's take let's take a look at the food first. We got these radishes. Now I'm not sure which stat is most important. So. Satiety? I, I looked this up. It, that doesn't sound like the proper, you know, pronunciation of that word, but I looked it up and Google said it's satiety. I don't know. Um, but I don't know what's more important, satiety or nutrition? I, I'm not really sure. So anyway, we've got four and ten. So I did make a campfire. Let's go ahead and cook. All right. So you go right here and you put in the ripe yam and you wait for it to cook. Very simple. Satiety. I, I just looked it up, guys. That's what Google said. Um, I think it's like, it comes from the word satiate. So like, satiate is satiety. I don't know. Anyway, we don't want to burn it, so let's take that off. We're going to cook a... Well, we won't cook another one just yet. Let's take a look. All right. So this is... Oh, so... Wait a minute. So the nutrition went down by cooking it? Oh, that's interesting. Nutrition's five. Nutrition's... I don't know. Whatever. All right, whatever. I'm just going to eat it. And then I just threw it, didn't I? No, I didn't do anything with it. There we go. And then E. I keep I keep left-clicking to eat, and I'm going to end up throwing stuff all the time. Uh, we're going to go ahead and just drink out of this little pond here. There we go. And now we're looking good. So, let me show you the what the bed costs. So, you can see right there, that's what the bed costs. And let me also show you what the campfire cost. Campfire is under function. And there you go, that's what the campfire cost. Now, the fire lick, all right, that's something new. That's these um, these things right here. And if you, try and, if you try and use a knife to get them, they catch on fire, uh, you wanna pull them up. Um, that's, that's the only way I could get them. If I use the knife, it would catch on fire. And I think that brings you guys just about the speed. Let me show you how I've been building the roof. First of all, do we have enough for the next part of the roof? I don't think we do. Let's take a look really quick. Um, not function, structure, roof, and I've been using these corner pieces. Oh, we do have enough. Okay, great. So, remember how I was telling you mouse, uh, use the middle mouse button to keep the camera behind your character? Well, here's the thing. I take that off when I'm building. Uh, so now I'm kind of like more free mode here. Uh, I can move stuff around, look at stuff easier, all that good stuff. And I'm going to also use control mouse wheel to zoom out. And I'm going to use right mouse button to bring up here and this gives you a much better building advantage especially when building the building vantage point especially when you're building roof pieces so let's go ahead and do that now and again i was using all the corner pieces just kind of basic there we go and then you mouse eh. if you look on the left hand side it tells you you could toggle uh grid mode build cancel hold precise attach i don't know what that is i'll probably mess around that later uh rotate align position and align angle so there we go. All right, looking good. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring my camera back into the position I want it to be in. And not have that in my inventory. It looks weird. I'm kind of like offset now with my character. I guess it really doesn't matter. Yeah, it's fine. 
All right, let's get that out of our hands and let's see what's next. Move the workbench into the house. Okay. Uh, I didn't know you could do that and I'm glad you can. Uh, where did I put the workbench? Wait, what? No, seriously. Is there multiple... Oh, haha! <laughs> oh yeah, there's multiple ponds. All right, fair enough. Oh, look, the workbench is taking damage from being outside. Look at that. You gotta hold it down. Yeah, so you, you gotta have them inside or they're gonna take damage. I don't know how to make a door, though. Uh, now do I just throw it or put down? There we go. Gotta move around like this and like right about there should be good. All right, so now I could, I could, um, uh, half position. Oh yeah, look at that. See, you can put it close to the wall now. Cool. I use G for that, by the way. Uh, build a straw bed using the shortcuts light to switch between crafting. Okay, so I already built the straw bed, which is really annoying. I, it doesn't seem like I could pick it up, so I'm gonna have to make another one. That's why, if they're gonna, they should have made you build the straw bed first, honestly. Uh, save sleep. It doesn't look like I can do anything with the straw bed, like pick it up or destroy it or anything. Switch build modes. Oh, demolish. All right, well we might as well. Um, shift. Did we get anything back? I don't think we did. It didn't seem like we did. All right, let's get rid of this hammer. Uh, cancel. Oh, maybe we did. I got six. Hold on. Yeah, yeah. I think I did get them back, actually. I think I got the resources back. It might have showed up on the screen and I just missed it. If it did, I apologize. It's a busy screen, so it's hard to keep track of everything. So, I guess I could just put this... Nah, I don't want to do it there. Let's do it here. There we go. Beautiful. Craft a flint spear and wooden armor on the workbench. All right. All right, I guess, um, I guess you don't need a door. The game hasn't told me to make a door. Uh, so, all right, flint spear. We need some rope. That won't be a problem. That's under materials. Well, I guess it will be a problem. I need some more common rush. By the way, check this out. When you get in the common, the common rush, you can just hold down the button and it goes a lot quicker. I wonder if you could do that with trees. Uh, no, you can't do it with trees. Trees are a completely different way to, to deal with, so... All right, fair enough. Put that away, and let's come on up here. And I already made the rope, by the way, so we're just going to make the spear now. And wooden armor. Okay. Uh, where do I want to put the spear? Let's put the spear right there. And we should have some wooden armor, so that's outfits. Oh, there you go. Ooh, look at all the little uh, colorful things. Fire weakness. Well, that's not good. Um, electro endurance. Very good. Craft that. Will it automatically... Go on. Why is there a Q thingy here? I'm not really sure. All right. So do I have to put... No, that's already on me. Okay, cool. Check out my new armor. Yeah, it looks dope. Talk to the guy. Okay. Is that is this the guy I'm supposed to talk to? Probably. This outfit looks good. I need your help for something. Take a good rest and come find me tomorrow. Uh, taking this time, you can make a grill. Cook food is more nutritious. And raw ingredients, a grill uh, starts with a bonfire. All right, cool. I uh, have enough wood and water. Uh, construct the bonfire stones. Okay. Let's take a look at the bonfire. I'm still getting used to uh, trying to find stuff in here. So let's see if we can find a bonfire. It's it's uh, It's got to be a function item, right? But I don't see... Oh, is that the bonfire? Oh, okay. All right. So we need some more wood and some more fire lick. So let me show you the fire lick. There you go. You just kind of make sure there's nothing in your hands and pull it up. You don't want it to... It, it will catch on fire. Trust me. <laughs> the name is accurate. Oops. Yeah, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Yeah, boy. Getting those crutes. So I guess we'll just make the bonfire like right here. I don't know. I don't know where to make it. I guess it really doesn't matter at the end of the day. Uh, bonfire, build. Oh, it's still kind of small. Why is it so small? Is it, if you can bonfire, it shouldn't be that small, right? Uh, construct the bonfire stones. Oh, okay. All right, my bad. Okay, so this is a bonfire with logs. This is a bonfire with stones. So I already made the bonfire. Okay, so this was a waste of time. Fair enough. Uh, hold tap to switch. Demolish. Alright, um, demolish. 
Hopefully we got all the stuff back on that. And we didn't. Ugh, son of a biscuits. Alright, so we need a couple more stones. So you get you get some of the stuff back, but not all of it. Come on. Oh, skate. Yeah, the, the game's really awesome. I'm really interested to see where it goes. But the gameplay and like some of the things are, is a little bit... It's taken some getting used to. The UI and the gameplay, a couple things, but... It's, it makes sense, though. It's all, I don't really have a problem with it. It's just going to take some time to get used to. Build. There you go. I already built this, man. Have enough food and water uh, and go to... Yeah, the next day. All right, fair enough. All right, well, let's get let's cook some more stuff. We put up more than one? Yeah, you can only make one at a time. I cooked myself a wooden grill rack thingy. Let me see exactly what it's called. Uh, it's right here. Yep, wooden grill rack, exactly. Just take out the thingy part. Uh, I made one of those, and then you hold it over your head, and you just kind of walk up here, and you attach it to your fire. And now I can cook more than one thing at a time. How dope is that? There we go. Looking good. And then we just take them off. This is great. So if we will sleep through the night tomorrow, we'll definitely be able to go talk to that guy. And Oh, crap. I took, uh, why did I take them off before they were done? It's weird. I was clicking them. And the second one, I thought... Don't click it. It's not done. And I clicked it anyway. I, I don't know what's wrong with me. I don't know if anything goes bad in this game. I, I don't think it does. Uh, I'm not seeing it if it says it goes bad. So we're just going to go ahead and cook it all. And then we're going to go to sleep. And then we're going to eat, drink, and go over there and see what that guy wants. I'm not going to cook these oak nuts. I don't know if I mentioned this already. But if I did already, I apologize. But I'm not going to cook the oak nuts because um, you could use them to plant trees. All right, looking good. Let's go ahead and go to sleep. When you go to sleep, you have this little big thing here. And I guess you pick when you want to wake up. I guess I'll wake up at 6 o'clock in the morning. There we go. And now I'm hungry. Well, actually, I'm not even that hungry. Damn, I thought I would have been more hungry than that. All right. Well, let's go ahead and eat. And one more. And one more. Cool. And let's go grab a drink. And we're good to go. Oh, look at that food bar. It's doing something crazy. Hold on. What is that? 110 of 101. Sweet. I got... I, I'm satiated, bro. All right, what do you want? You're here. Good timing. Uh, what trouble are you in? Uh, there is a force in this place called the... Whatever that is. They are notorious for their evil deeds. Uh, blah, blah, blah. It seems like... Yeah, cool. I gotta go kill people. Uh, we'll split up and take action. You go ahead and handle. Okay. By the way, here's a little trick for you. If you get thirsty on the way, you can, you can use it to carry water and drink. Okay, cool. Nice. That's very good. Um, let's go ahead and... Uh, yeah, it's good as number nine. And uh, fill with water. Awesome. Okay, defeat, defeat guys. Well, I don't have a weapon yet. So... Oh, no, I have a spear. That's right. Okay. So let's go this way, and let's go and defeat some bozos. Uh, F8's a save, right? There we go. He got the spear. Oh, he puts it on his back when he's running. That's weird. <clears throat> All right, here we go. R to lock on. And then you kind of jump around with, um, uh, with control. Oh, there we go. What is this guy? He looks like a bug. Cool. Drop some loot. Yep, give me all that loot. Oh, radishes. Cool. Um, ow. I'm still locked onto something. There we go. Uh, sitting on the chair. Sitting on a chair or a tree stump can boost your hit points recovery and slightly restore your spirit. Nice. Sit, lift up. Okay, I'm going to take that home with me. These things are little um, tip tip things. They tell you, you know, they give you tips. Do you demolish a building, hold, tab, and select? Yeah, I already figured that one out. All right. Uh, can we get under there? Um, skeleton under there. Am I supposed to go under there? It doesn't look like I'm supposed to go under there. All right. Hey, what's up? Uh, Want to play together? But first, you have... You, uh, you have to show some talent. What do you mean talent? 
Um, chat, please join my party. Yeah, join my party. Uh, yes. Although I am interested in teaming up. Now is not the time. I still don't trust you enough. Okay, let's chat a little bit. Oh my goodness. Okay. Um, may I ask your name? There you go. Uh, daily talk. I'm not going to read all this, by the way. If you want to, like, read all this, you can pause the video and read it. About the area. Oh, this might be a uh, friend. I heard that once a snowy mountain that saw a pear tree happened to be uh, thirsty. Okay, fair enough. Let's go our preferences. Mm -hmm. Back. Please join me party chat. I guess that's it. Can you join my party now? Uh, now is not the time. Okay, well, I don't know what you want from me. So <laughs> I'm going to take this thing home. And, um, yeah, killing the disciples of Jar will definitely seek revenge. Enhance your strength and do a job of giving Jar... Is it Jar? Jar? I'm going to call him Jar. Uh, attack for two days. Okay. Um, put down... Yeah, let's put it right there. And then I could sit on it. There I go. Build a wooden sign to mark your location. Try building a wooden sign to mark important location. Uh, the recipe for wooden sign is obtained uh, through crafting a uh, wooden stick. Okay, can I can I craft wooden stick? Because I was looking to craft wooden sticks earlier. I couldn't figure out how. So, yeah, I can craft wooden sticks now. I couldn't earlier, but I can now. So, there we go. How many should I make? I don't know. Let's craft um, one, I guess. Oh, now we can do a lot of different things. All right, cool, cool. Uh, wooden sign. That's got to be under the build menu, right? Where would that be? Structure, furniture? That sign? No. Wouldn't hang. Uh, wooden racks for what? Oh, you can hang your tool. Oh, that's cool. I think this game's gonna be really fun, by the way. Um, uh, wooden spike. Wood oh, defenses. Maybe I should make some of those. Does it say to make defenses? Yeah, it doesn't say anything about specifically for defenses, but I would imagine that would make sense. All right, furniture. Yeah, I'm not sure where this wooden sign is. There we go. I found it. Um, build. And I guess I'll just put this right here. Uh, seems like a good spot for it. Cool. Uh, wooden sign, open, enter text. What, what are we gonna name this place? Um, to be determined. Cool. Now, the only thing I have to do right now is wait for the jar to attack. Will, will this person like join me now that I have a wooden sign? Probably not, but. Like, oh, what is that? Building recipe. Wait, what? Is that what that said? Oh, wooden square chair. Cool. Uh, why? Why did you lock me up? I didn't lock you up. How do I let it, like let him out of there? Uh, uh, refugee, civilian. That's all their stuff. Chat, please join my party. Uh, join my party. Yeah, not the right time. Okay, I'm not really sure how to break him out of there. I'd like to, like... Oh, hold on. Hold on, I see some options. Um, Switch to Axe. Okay. I didn't want to do this because she's in there, but... Let's save just in case. Because I'd imagine this is going to kill her. Yeah, maybe not. I should have been like, I'll let you out if you join my party. Where are you going? Alright, can you join my party now? I'm gonna try one more time. I just saved your life. I think you should join my party. Hi, you really have good taste. Uh, okay. Cool, we got we got somebody. All kinds of commands and stuff. I think we're gonna look at that next episode. <laughs> but we do have someone. Let's go. Let's go. So all you have to do is all you have to do is save them. Yeah, that's fine. I just I didn't want to start bashing the thing with an axe because I was afraid it was gonna like hurt her. I thought that I'd be able to open that thing or something, but. All right, guys, you know what? I do think I am going to call this one here. If you guys want to see more of this game, I hope you do, because I'm actually liking it quite a bit. I'm liking it even more than I thought I was going to like it. So that is really cool. And if you guys like it and you want to see more, make sure to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.